Raise your hands if you have testes. I'm Pigeon. I'm Ella. I'm Emily. I'm Cypher. And we are Intersexy. Intersex describes a person who doesn't fit the typical definition of male or female. I have XY chromosomes, but typical female genitalia. I'm a girl who has testes and XY chromosomes. I identify as a queer, gender nonconforming intersex person. I identify as a black intersex man. Intersex is not new. It's been around since the beginning of human existence. I mean, there's probably even intersex dinosaurs, if you think about it. I gave my mom the excuse that the internal testes were cancerous, that I would develop cancer. They didn't even come up with an excuse, basically, in terms of a health-related reason. They instead just said it was about the appearance. A lot of doctors are very uncomfortable with the idea that I have testes, and they're still trying to get them removed. But I'm perfectly healthy, and there's nothing wrong with them. They did a surgery to remove my testes and told my parents to take me home and just raise me as a girl and I didn't find out about it myself until I was 12. There aren't a lot of options or medical providers don't explore other options. My mom would put me in dresses and she would be like, oh, aren't you so cute and you're so pretty? And I would be like, no, nah, this is horrible. Ah. I was um, put on hormonal treatment, which consisted of estrogen and progesterone. I just wanted to belong. I wanted to fit in. I didn't want to be different. So even though I knew something felt amiss, I conformed. He was very condescending. He was like, you intersex activists don't know what you're talking about. It's difficult for intersex people to find each other because from an early age we're told not to talk about our bodies. I did feel like I was the only one. My doctors always told me there was nobody else like me. And so it just perpetuates a vicious cycle of shame and stigma that we can't break out of. I would tell another intersex person that you are worthy. You are lovable. Your body is beautiful. You're beautiful. Intersex people don't need to be fixed. There's nothing wrong with them. I know you feel like you might not be able to get through this. I know you might have really dark thoughts, but I want you to know that meeting other intersex people and finding a community or a support group can be one of the most important aspects in your healing process. And we're out there. We're out here. We're here. And I just hope you can find us.